friends, it's me, Faith. Today I'm going to read the Jesus Calling book. Sorry, one second. Today we're going to read The Tower to the Heavens from Genesis 11. God made people so they can jump and run and do all sorts of wonderful things. God also created us to work together to do great things for him. Everyone should thank God for these gifts, but some people try to use their skills for themselves instead. That's why that's what happened to at a place called Babel. Rather than saying that God was great and thanking him, the people began to fill up with pride, thinking that they were great. In fact, they thought they were as great as God. Let's build a tower to the heavens, they said. One that we... One that will be remembered forever. We can stand on top. People will look up and say, wow, there's something special. God didn't want the people to become so full of pride. If he didn't stop them, they would become sinful as people from the big flood. And God cared about them too much to allow that to happen. Stop them. God confused their speech. Camel your bucket hat. No, said someone. Harry's. Harry birds free on top, says another. Tickle that run and donkey, shouted the former man. What? No one understood what anybody else said. They became f confused and grumpy. Soon the people start stopped building the tower and the city altogether. God used their confusion to make them and live in different places where they raised family and spoke on their own languages. That's why they are called different languages of the world. That's why there are thousands of different languages in the world. Plans fail when people work apart with God, from God. God. No one is greater than he is. Just the first. Next page, and we're going to read Jesus Calling. I am the vine, you are the branches. If a man rem remains in me and I uh, and I in him, he will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. John fifteen five says, I am the Lord, the God and creator of all things. I have given you gifts, making you able to build with your hands and run with your feet and speak with your mouth. When you use those gifts in a good way, because you love me, you feel happy. I love seeing you enjoy what I have given you. But when, I, when you do things selfishly apart from me, it is not good for anyone. I want you to live close to me. Talk with me often through your prayers. I am always listening. I like that description. Please don't forget to press subscribe or ring the bell so you can enjoy my other new videos. Bye!